good morning guys and welcome back to my youtube channel this video is going to be a week in my life because i kind of want to give y'all like a sneak peek on what i do during my day to day because i really only post my job videos like when i'm home i don't really be posting and i kind of want to change that because i want to get more consistent with youtube and i have a busy week this week but today's agenda is i work for those who don't know i do have a remote job um so i work a nine to five really like nine to four but a nine to five nine to whatever um then i have to get gas put air on my tire i really don't want to do that like anything car related i just be wanting my brothers or my dad to do maybe my dad might do it before you go to work um then i have a collab yeah 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 i've been getting so many collabs first off if you don't follow me on instagram go follow me on instagram and tiktok at the mayana mallory um i post like a lot of things to do when i'm in different cities but for my hometown right now what i'm really focusing on is just highlighting that there's fun things to do in connecticut because everybody be saying connecticut boring and don't get me wrong sometimes it do be boring so it do be hard to find stuff to do but that's why y'all got me because i'm doing the work and doing the research and i'm putting y'all on to find different stuff to do. So yes, yeah, so I have Penthouse a put blah, 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 blah. cancel. I have a collab with them. They do candle making and painting, um, like the Calls Bear painting. So yeah. Um, and then I need to get my eyebrows done. Y'all, these are so bad. I'm so, I, w I wanted my lady to do my eyebrows before I like had to do my work and stuff, but she didn't have no appointments available. So I'm going after the collab. Um, and then I have some business meetings for those who don't know. I also do graphic design, website design, marketing, and social media, social media marketing for small businesses. Um, and like just sometimes some like other influencers or like, you know, people who have personal brands, I help them like elevate their social media presence. So I had two meetings with people today to talk about a possible website design and just figure out like what I could do, um, to help one client. So I'm really excited for that. Y'all can follow my business page at Mallory Media Group. And if you ever need anything for your business, y'all know who to come to. But yeah, so that's what I gotta do for today. So yeah. Yeah. Y'all just gonna y'all just gonna really spend a day, spend a week with me. Um, so yeah, let's get to it. Hey guys, so we are now at sun Penthouse Poor. The sun is all in our eyes. We are at Penthouse Poor and yeah, excited to collab. Okay guys, so I put this little meme on my candle and this is our candles. They can smell it black. I know, <laughs> I don't know why I thought they did. It smelled, my candle smells really good. Hers is giving like a little linen vibe. It smells good. Like a black. Sunday cleaning, a Sunday cleaning. That's what this Mine is. Mine is like fruity. It is, it's like the springtime <laughs> summer. I think it's really good, it smells good. Yes, this place is really cute and it's fun. It's such a hidden gem. I can't wait to make the video. Um, by the time I post this vlog, I'll have the video done, video done. So I'll probably insert it after this clip. But yeah. The hospitality um, was great. Yes, the hospitality was great. She's very sweet. It's woman owned. Uh, next, I have my eyebrow appointment and I have some business meetings. Um, and then we're wrapping it up for the name. Okay, y'all, it is 8.20. I am just now getting home from getting my eyebrows done. And luckily, I was able to do one of my client calls in the car because it was via phone. And my other two calls, um, the client tax to reschedule. So it kind of worked out perfect because not gonna lie, your girl is tired. But yeah, she ate my eyebrows. Um, so I did edit the video. I literally just edited it like as soon as I sat down. It probably took me like five to 10 minutes. I don't know how I edit so fast. Um, let me see if the camera gonna focus. Okay. Yeah, I literally I edited in CapCut. And this is my experience today at the um, candle making place. So yeah, I'm probably gonna post that Tuesday or Wednesday. I'm thinking Tuesday, cause Wednesday I might 
get cute and take pictures to bounce on my feet. I don't know. Um, I feel like I should show you the behind the scenes of my voiceover. They usually don't take me long camp front. Like, I be recording mine. Sometimes I get it. If a good night, it's gonna take me one try. A bad night, it's like a three to five times try. But I just act like I'm on FaceTime talking to my friends. But because I'm recording, I'm gonna act like I'm talking to y'all. Well, I'm not gonna act like I'm talking to y'all because I am talking to y'all. But for me, you get it. All right, let's get into this voiceover. Put my little TikTok voice on. Three, two, one. Hey, hey, I found the perfect girls' night, date night, or solo date in Connecticut for you, and it's called Penthouse Pour. Vision board this year, and that's. First of all, I'm talking too slow and it's too wordy. So I'm gonna cut out a listing everything that I added. Okay, let's try again. I look forward to coming back with more of my friends too. If you want. I just know I wasn't gonna like that. And what's crazier is I wasn't recording the audio. A few minutes later. Soon, if you want to jump on CT gems like this, follow me for more. Bye. And we ate and left no crumbs. Yeah. Hey, hey, I found the perfect girls' night or date night in Connecticut for you, and it's called Penthouse Pour, located in downtown Hartford. It's a woman-owned candle-making studio that's such a fun experience. From the moment we walked in, Melissa was very warm and inviting, setting the perfect tone for our first candle-making class. We were guided through the entire process, which was informative and easygoing. While we waited for our candles to dry, we made vision boards for the new year. There were also light refreshments and beverages available. I look forward to coming back with more of my friends soon. If you want to drop on CT gems like this, follow me for more. Bye. Today is Tuesday, and as you can tell, it's not morning time, so I am not coming to y'all in the morning. It's night. It's um like 5 o'clock right now, and I'm getting ready to go do a content day with my client. She's having a photo shoot, so she wants some behind-the-scenes content and for me to edit it and all of that. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So if y'all want to book that, book with me. Um, So yeah, I'm going to be showing y'all, taking y'all along with me as I do that. And then after, I'm going to grab food with my sister from Longhorn. Then I'm going home and I'm calling it a night camp front because I'm just so tired today. Um, I'm lying. I might do some editing, but yeah. Come Tuesday, which is why I really didn't vlog in the morning, but tomorrow, tomorrow then we'll go to Panera and do work. But yeah, anyways, let's get to the behind the scenes. I be in a Hey y'all, happy Friday. I know I did not record Wednesday and Thursday like I was supposed to, but that's only because I worked remote those days and then I did like my graphics and websites when I got off of work. So feel me like, I really just didn't want y'all watching me from a screen, not from a screen, just do work on my laptop because it was, it was boring. One day I will show the behind the scenes. One day I'll do like a day in the life as a graphic designer or like my five to nine after my nine to five, whatever soon come soon come but nonetheless today is friday yeah i get off early on fridays um so i have two collabs today i have a collab with this spot called jordan's hot dogs and max and actually it's so crazy because i've never been like ever since they opened i've always wanted to try them so my first time trying them will definitely be a collab and then mighty donuts which i also have never been to um but i've seen them it's like a donut spot um so i have both of those today i might run to the mall it's an exciting week, like, this week has been packed with collabs. I've been getting collab offers. Like, when I went to um, the candle place that y'all have went with me, when I go on Monday, was that Monday? I think that was Monday. That video has 5,302 likes, and it has over 51,000 views, um, and over 1,500 saves, and over 3,000 shares. And I only posted that three days ago. So it's like, yeah, like I'm really that girl. Like my content is really doing amazing. And I love that because I just like to show the beauty of like what CT got made in gyms, feel me? I'm gonna keep showing off the stuff and keep um, growing my page. Right now I'm at 5,277 followers. On Monday, I was at like 5,000 followers. So posting reels and being consistent with content definitely helps, but that's gonna be another video in itself. 
I'm put y'all on with. But yeah, I'm excited. I'm landing paid collabs now, so yeah, period. But yeah, let's get to it um before I'm late. Bye. <laughs> So the place was a 10 out of 10. It was good. I liked the hot dog. The hot dog was fire. 10 out of 10. The steak and cheese fries was really good. 10 out of 10. I definitely got my steak on top. Well done. I don't care what nobody said. Um, the what else did I get? A Georgia hot. The Georgia hot was good, but I am a person that doesn't like doesn't like spicy stuff, and this was my first time having a Georgia hot for real. So yeah but it was really good like it was not nasty it was good i just don't like spicy stuff so it was good and on top of that i had water so if i had like no i'm i had some strawberry lemonade which was fire so good and i love lemonade um yeah so highly recommend visiting there i'm actually about to go right back in front and capture some more content but what i will say is next time one of my friends better come with me because i'm at the table looking like i'm greedy i got two hot dogs and fries in front of me and i look greedy and i wasn't trying to get greedy um all right so i just got to the mall and um this is one of the trash malls in ct this is vilford mall um honestly i'm not really looking for nothing in particular so i'm like well let me just go to milford just to see like if they have anything if this is my one lucky day but if you're from connecticut if you know you know the milford mall has went downhill these past few years and they'll never be having nothing like i low-key knew coming in here they really wasn't gonna have nothing i did get a shirt from H&M, which is really gonna go cute with this brunch outfit I have in mind. And I'm gonna have to get some cute jeans, maybe off a pretty little thing or something. Um, and yeah, I think I'm actually, while I'm out here, because I still got some time before I need to go to my second collab, um, I'm gonna go to Plato's Closet and see if I can thrift me some cute stuff. Because I follow them on Instagram and they posted some cute little stuff lately, so. We gonna see what they're working with. It's really just giving order online, and that's just what I'm gonna do probably sometime this week when I go home. Well, actually, I'm about to get an oil change, so I ended up getting these really cute jeans. I found them in the men's section. They was only eleven dollars, and they fit real nice. And yeah, so now I need to go get an oil change. The oil change place is 26 minutes from me. Hopefully, I've been making it. My my anything been saying service due now for like a week, um, and that's not funny because I like been needing to go. Thinking maybe things were never the way we made them out to be. How we thought they were. Lately, I'm not sure. One thing for sure is when we're together, the time to get together. Really all right yeah that place is fire 10 out of 10 the donuts i had was so so good um and the lemonade was fire if you know me you know i love lemonade and if i vouch that the lemonade is good trust me the lemonade is good but yeah i really hope people come and visit after i post my content because i think it's a spot everybody should know about i'm sorry i'm talking fast my camera about to die but i'm about to go go-kart i think he said we're going go-kart racing or bowling one of them i'm about to hang out and i'm probably not gonna bring my camera one because it's gonna die and i'm not breaking my camera but i may get some content for y'all if i don't i will see y'all tomorrow good morning y'all okay well actually good afternoon so i just got home off work and i like shower refresh or whatever because i have a content day with a client yeah i really love content days um for those of you who don't know i do like social media management content creation website design graphic design anything you need for social media marketing i'm your girl so i have a client today who does juicing um and i'll be going with her to do a content day yeah let's get to it
problem is we're not discussing all that screaming, yelling, it's not becoming to you. Things just can't be fixed without a time. Hey y'all, happy Sunday. So my content day ended up going longer than I planned. So I didn't go to my friend's house to celebrate her birthday. Um, sorry Maureen, it's all love. We're gonna be celebrating this week. Um, so yeah, and that's why I didn't end the video, like do a like outro yesterday because I was just so tired. I literally got home, got some pizza, showered and went to bed. I was so tired. Um, but today is Sunday. Feeling a little bit more refresh, refreshed. I got to sleep in a little bit. Um, so I just want to thank y'all for watching a week in my life. A very, very hectic week in my life. Um, and yeah, I'm looking forward to doing more of these. If you did like this type of content, this style video, be sure to like this video, comment, and subscribe. And I will see y'all next week. Bye.